This transmission network model example demonstrates the use of QV curves. QV curves is one of the options available in transmission network tools. For this example study KSO5 transmission network tools QV, and scenario base scenario should be active. QV curves can be used when analyzing the voltage stability of a network. They show the sensitivity of the voltage of a node with respect to injected reactive power. A node is stable under particular conditions as long as increased reactive power is associated with increased voltage. First we will check that the base load flow has a valid solution. The transmission network tools toolbar should be selected. This button can be used to start the QV curves analysis. It is possible to run the analysis for all nodes in the network or just the selection. In this example, we will examine the northwest part of the network by selecting just the bus bars in that area. Then we press execute to start the calculation. In the output window, we can see that the two most critical bus bars are these two, which are at substation NW03, and the critical voltage is 0.883 per unit. We can now use the QV curves plot button to plot a QV curve for the most critical bus bar. In order to analyze the most critical nodes more carefully, we can select them using the links in the output window and then return to the QV curves calculation option. The set of nodes to be analyzed can be modified. We will consider just the two NW03 bus bars. This time we will also consider contingencies in the calculation. We will consider all the bus bar faults in the northeast. The analysis is now started. It can be seen that the critical contingency is a bus bar fault in substation NE04, and the critical voltage is 0.923 per unit. 